I saw with my eyes as the moon turned to blood and the stars they fell out of the sky. I saw with my eyes as the sky turned to flames and Jerusalem she burned. I watched as the waters retreated and laid bare the shore. I saw as the blast it destroyed everything and I asked my God what for. It won't be long till all these things come to pass. They have been signs of what is yet to come. Many have had visions and dreams. The day of the Lord, soon it will come. It's almost time, it's almost time. The day of the Lord, soon will come. Prepare your hearts, it's almost time. The day of the Lord soon will come. It's almost time. It's almost time. The day of the Lord soon will come. Prepare your hearts. It's almost time. I saw with my eyes as the moon turned to blood and the stars they fell out of the sky. I saw with my eyes as the sky turned to flames and Jerusalem she burned. I watched as the waters retreated and laid bare shore. I saw as the blast it destroyed everything and I asked my God what for. It won't be long till all these things come to pass. They have been signs of what is to come. Many have had visions and dreams of the end. It will not be the way they all expect. The day of the Lord soon will come. It's almost time, it's almost time. The day of the Lord soon will come. Prepare your heart, it's almost time. The day of the Lord soon will come. It's almost time, it's almost time, the day of the Lord soon will come. Prepare your heart, it's almost time. 
All right. I saw this. I saw this. I saw with my eyes as the moon turned to blood. I was driving. It was nighttime. It was an open vision. I was driving. My eyes were open. And it was a full moon right above me. And the moon instantaneously turned dark blood red. It wasn't like a blood moon night, guys. It was the white moon instantly turned blood red. And then all the little twinkly stars next to and around the moon in the sky above me started falling down to the ground. I saw it. I saw with my eyes as the sky turned to flames and Jerusalem she burned. I had a flash vision of that. God showed me the flash vision. And I knew it was Jerusalem. I watched as the water retreated and laid bare the shore. Oh yeah, I did. He gave that to me as a vision. The water's being sucked out to the ocean because a tsunami was going to come and destroy the city. I saw as the blast, it destroyed everything. And I asked my God, what for? Why are you showing me these things, God? I saw the nuclear blast. Not only did I see it, but I experienced it as an experience. I was inside the man who was running and he was running past a skyscraper with, with glass all across it. So he could see, I could see. And then he dropped down to the ground and the blast from the nuclear explosion. I mean, this all happens instantaneously. The blast went over his body. I felt the heat of it. I experienced it. Flash, it was over. But when he was dropping down to the ground, he said, Jesus, Jesus, save me. It won't be long till all these things come to pass. So I asked my God, why did you show me these things? It won't be long till all these things come to pass. They have been signs of what is yet to come. Many have had visions and dreams of the end. It will not be the way they expect. Will there be a tsunami that takes out New York City? Probably not. It had a spiritual meaning though. It had a spiritual meaning. The skyline of Jerusalem on fire. Maybe that one's going to happen. I mean, I don't know for sure, but like I did get a word about that from the Lord. Again, fire does symbolize purification and burning up what's, what's dead. God does do that. He burns away what's dead. But maybe it'll be a destruction also. I mean, that one maybe. You know, prophecy. Prophecy. But the day of the Lord, soon it will come. It's almost time. It's almost time. Prepare your hearts. It's almost time. God told me he's coming soon. I mean, Jesus says, I'm near. He tells me, I'm near. I'm coming soon, Jesus telling me. And that's why he told me to warn the people, warn you. And God said, teach them doctrine through song because my children perish for a lack of knowledge. They don't know anything. That's what God said about his children. They know nothing. So teach doctrine through song. Teach the scripture in a way that they can, they can learn. That's what God told me to do. When he told me to write the musical, the musical called The Revelation of Jesus Christ, which I've been doing since 2017. And this was song number 584. I'm getting to 600 songs. That's 16 songs to go. 16 songs to go. And God said when I hit song 600, it will symbolize the, the completion, the completion of the 6,000 years. What happened after the sixth day? What did God do on the seventh day? He rested. And there's promise in the scripture about what's coming in the seventh, as it were, day. The 7,000th year. 
I mean, we're on the cusp now. Only God knows the timing. But once the 6,000 years is done, it's done. You're into the 7,000th year, right? You're into the 7,000th year. You're at the beginning of it. You're not at the end of it. It's not about to turn 8,000th year yet. You're at the beginning of the 7,000th year. I think, right? You're born at zero. It's the first year. And when you hit one, when you turn one, you've, you've attained the age of one. And then you're like one year and one month, you're headed towards two at that point. You've attained one, right? All right. This song about the day of the Lord, soon it will come. God bless you. Don't be deaf. Don't be deaf. Listen. DNF. DNF. There's a tower in the old part of town, and it's chiming. D-E-F. Do you have an ear, E-A-R, to hear H-E-A-R? His heart, H-E-A-R-T. Do you hear T? Do you hear me? Do you hear me? I've been warning you. Time is tick tock, tick tock. I mean, sounds like a clock tower to me, chiming away. The D and the F. Maybe it's not about being deaf. Maybe it's about death. 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 God bless you.